Getting website clients has never been easier. I'm going to show you the simple foot in the door strategy that I've used. Also, I've seen other people using it as well. They had a lot of success. Of course, we're going to do it with go high level and you can sell these websites and back end services on a monthly reoccurring basis. Now, look, I know go high level has all these crazy features and automations, but let's just focus in on one. All right. The one that will get you the profit. Now you can just use these in order to charge anywhere from two, three, four, even $500 per month just for this one, this one service. All right. And I'm going to even show you, and I'm going to teach you an outreach strategy that you can use to get clients for this particular service. Of course, we're going to use go high level. So let's just go and do it. First things first, you know how to make a website template here on go high level. I'm not going to go through that because I don't want to make this video too long, but basically just choose any template out there in your niche, whatever your niche is. For example, I have built this template. This is like for some chiropractors, whatever. And I just want you to go and change all of this information inside of this, like to your best knowledge about that certain industry. It can be, I don't know, roofing, it can be dentists, chiropractors, basically whatever you are specialized in. All right. So just build the template. Now, what I want you to leave out is the logo. All right. Wherever you feel like there's should be a logo, just leave that open. I'm going to tell you why. Now, after you build something like this, some website template for you, just save it. And after that, you have like this tool, which is really, really perfect. It's called Phantom Buster. I've used this one before and there's honestly, there's like probably tons of other Chrome extensions and like a bunch of Google My Business extractors that you can find for free. This one is paid. All right. You got to pay for this one, but I have the most experience with this one. So I just like to use it. If you want, you can just go and use another one, which is like free, whatever. But what this allows you to do is to extract the data from Google Maps. All right. So this is what you have to do. Once you have the extension, you can just take, for example, the whole Google Maps on what's on your screen and you will get a nice CSV file with all of the info on those businesses. So we can just start contacting them. All right. It's a really good tool. If you know of any other one, which is, I don't know, maybe free or paid, just let me down in the comments. I'm going to check them out, but I just like Phantom Buster. You can use it or not, whatever. Now, now, I do want to tell you one thing. There is a big problem with reaching out to businesses and just offering like a lot of these go high level services. I know that go high level has a lot of these automations, a lot of these features, but you know what's the big problem? Well, they just cold email and outreach to all of these businesses and they do not provide any value up front. These people are just contacting them and they just want to take from them. All right. They do not want to give anything up front, especially for free. So they're going to go and say, hey, we'll get you more leads. Oh, we're going to get you more appointments or do you need automations? And they're just trying to sell all these different things, but they're not providing value. And what I found and what I've seen that works the best is by giving something up front, give them some kind of value, you know, maybe teach them something, maybe show what their competitors are doing. You know, that's a really big secret of mine. And I have found that this really works. We can actually show them something that they have not seen before. For example, if you're doing a sales call, if you're doing like a presentation, a meeting with the business owner, well, after that meeting, they should walk away knowing something that they didn't know before. All right. That's the key point. That's been my secret. And this way you just stay in their mind. You know, so when they do need something now, let's say they do not need a website right now. So it's not in demand for them. Or let's just say they're not interested into getting some more Google reviews at the time. But then in the future, you know, when they actually do need that service or when they're thinking about digital marketing or when it comes to their mind, they're thinking about you. All right, because they actually learn something. And this is the best way that you can cut through the noise. And that's exactly why I like our foot in the door strategy. So here's exactly what you're going to do. First of all, I'm going to show you the outreach message. So this is like a message template. And this one, of course, can be used in all of the niches out there. You can, of course, use it 
you're free to just copy and paste. So it's gonna go like this. So, hey, are you still open? I found a couple things broken on your website. Of course, you're gonna get this website from Phantom Buster, whatever. It's gonna give you like a lot of options. And even if they don't have a website, even that if they just don't have a domain yet, that's another bigger opportunity for you. Now what you can do, here's what I did. I just searched for some roofers in Las Vegas, for example. Now, if they don't have a website, you can show them their competitors, right? So you can just go to more businesses. This can be extracted as well. And then you can just show them their competitors. You show them all these companies that are bigger than them. And you can show them their website. And you can show them that even what these websites, like these bigger ones, what they have wrong, you know? So now they just trust you even more. Then you go on and say, when I was searching for a dentist in XYZ city, of course, you change the niche and cities. That's going to be totally up to you. And then you go, I actually fixed it for you and rebuilt a couple of things. Would it be cool if I send you a link to the new website on this email? Let me know if you like it. All right. So that is the whole thing. This is short and concise. You send them the value up front. But now you're just wondering, what am I going to show to them? Well, you're just going to show them what you've made, that website template. And you will just paste the logo of theirs in that template. And this way you can just contact a lot of new people. And then when they just ask you, okay, what is wrong about my website? If they have a website or the competitor's website, you can see, for example, you can just ask them on a phone call. Okay. Do you want to bring more leads? And the answer is going to be yes. Right? So you can just tell them, okay, we have found that if you put your phone number at the top, and if you just animate a little bit of that button, you will get more phone calls. I've seen a lot of businesses that are just putting this way down below. So this call today or just a phone number here, even better. They just put that all the way down and people are just looking for it and they will get more conversions if they just put this phone number up. All right. So that is the first trick. Of course, they're going to get more leads with it. I mean, it's just like simple logic. And then you are already in there and then you can just sell some back end services. So you can just sell automation services. You can tell them, all right, if someone contacts you, do you want this automated to send to those people certain text message or something? And trust me, it'll work. And you can just easily get yourself like three to four five hundred dollars by just operating this way. We've got a lot of people out there who just pay a, like $150, you know, just for keeping the website alive. And then you have the opportunity to upsell, to sell a lot of these other things. But do not stretch yourself too thin because you should focus on two to three services. You know, just focus on those because, well, you can be jack of all trades, right? Then, of course, you can just tell them that they need more Google reviews. So, for example, you just contact this one. You tell them, hey, I've seen that you've got only 19 reviews. But, for example, this company, which is your competitor, they've got 53. So, you can just ask them, okay, do you get like 20, 30 clients from the past? Or I don't know, do you think that you will be able to compete with these people if you've just got like 20 or 30 more reviews? And the answer is going to be yes. And then you just go with Google reviews, you know? So there's a lot of opportunities. You just have to go and think through it. And of course, as I've told you, you got to focus on certain things. So do not lose your Focus. Stick to the things that you know, stick to the things that you have passion for, but just use this outreach message and do not be afraid. You know, there's a lot of things that all of these business owners are missing out on, you know, and you already know it. You got a talent for it. Otherwise, you wouldn't do this. So just go and visit their websites and provide value first. All right. No one is doing this. No one is going, OK, I will do something for free for you. Or I will do something and you can you can just pay me afterwards. Or if you do not like it, you don't have to pay me. Just do something beforehand. And if they do not need your service right away, they will remember you because they're going to say, oh, it was that guy who just built me a website completely for free and I didn't need it at a time. But let me ask that guy if he knows something about this. That is the way, you know, 
just provide the value first people will respect you more and you will just have a lot of gigs later on yeah be creative work hard on it provide value first wish you good luck and i'll catch you in the next video